Alright guys and welcome to a bit of a tutorial how to do the PS4 remote play to your Macintosh. So this is going to be the first time I'm going to be doing it so let's just get into it. So use this computer, connect a DualShock so that's the first thing you've got to do. Connect your DualShock via USB to your Mac and there we are. Press start. Okay so I'm going to opt to manually register my PS4 with my Mac, go to remote play connection settings, add device and the number quickly comes up so you have to type it in. This looks like it's working this time. Cool, the following user has connected using remote play. Whoa, check that out. So, what happens when I Activate the controller. Whoa, that's pretty cool. And we're good to go. Check it out! And I can tell you that it's pretty much seamless like between the television and uh, the Mac here. This is pretty good. Like, I'm never going to get any work done now. Like, But uh, check it out. So, can we full screen this? Full screen it. This is pretty cool like so I think it's uh, max resolution is 7 720p but it's kind of good like um, change that there press any button Actually, pretty cool. Like, let's get into some gameplay. Very cool. See if I can actually like resize the window. So that's as small as it goes. Um. I'd say there's maybe like a little bit of a lag, a little bit of a tiny lag. Turn that uh, music off. Ooh. It's definitely really cool though, I mean. Check it out. Maybe a tiny lag, but not too much, but it's pretty good, I mean. I mean, this tally that I'm playing on is like rubbish, to be honest with you. Like, so it's actually uh, locked at 720p anyway. But yeah, there you go. So it's as simple as that. I decided to manually register it because it was taking too long when it was searching for it. So I will suggest that you register instead of waiting for it to connect unless you've got a better connection than me anyway guys this was just a quick tutorial test on a ps4 remote play at the mac thanks for watching and i'll talk to you in the next one